Welcome to the City of Commerce Veterans Research Center 411. This is where you get all the information veteran related. Today we're going to talk about the Brain Fuse Vet Now Job Now program that the library has to offer for all veterans, family members, and the general public. The Vet Now portion of this program will give you extra information in regards to unemployment benefits, um, claims that you may have filed, uh, job resources, and just a, a wide variety of information that will hopefully be accessible and that can help you. In order to get into this uh, program, you need to have a library card, go to the library's website, and under services, you'll see the Veterans Resource Center. You can go ahead and click on that. This takes you directly to the Veterans Resource Center homepage. Scroll down, and right below the video of me, of course, go ahead and click on Brain Fuse Vet Now. Once you click on there, the login page will pop up. You can go ahead and type in your barcode number. And go ahead and click login. And this takes you directly to the main page for Vet Now. I highly suggest that you create an account so that you can save any information that you may be doing on this site. To do that, just go into Login. And in the box right below where it says Login, it says, don't have a username or password, sign up. So you can go ahead and click on there on Sign Up and enter your information and then in the future you'll be able to just log in with your username and password. So now that you are signed up and ready to go, you'll see that there's a whole bunch of tools for people who are looking for jobs, but there's also the unemployment assistance which is um, really important uh, now, nowadays. You'll also see that there's a veteran section and there's a learner section for those of you that are interested in returning back to school or possibly taking an exam for an upcoming job. So we'll do the unemployment assistance section first because I know that there are probably a lot of you out there that are interested in this area. See, so if you click on the unemployment assistance, you'll see that there's actually a live navigator that can help you through the benefit claim process and then there's online resources. Uh, the navigator is only available certain days and times of the week, so you have to make sure that you um, uh, access them during those specific times, otherwise you're not able to get a hold of anyone, but they are there to help you. The online resources, uh, if you go to unemployment, back up to the unemployment insurance, And if you click on unemployment insurance, which I didn't do, but here we go, I'm gonna do it now. You'll see that there's information on your employment benefits, health, health coverage, and just a wide um, area of other programs that may be available for you. This section will uh, educate you on how the unemployment service works, what happens with your claim, um, how, you, how you apply, uh, who doesn't qualify, any information that you may need. But again, remember that there is someone live certain days of the week and certain times that you can actually uh, go on and connect with them and they can give you any specific information that you may want. Also, uh, just know that there are other programs that are available, such as uh, vocational training. If you can see, there's uh, different areas, different programs that are here. Some of them are free. If you go to the American Job Center, you'll find a lot of information there, and you can find out if you qualify for any of the free programs. There's also information for uh, temporary assistance if it's needed. 
if we go back to the home page, we can go to our next section. Now we are going to click on job resources. So if you are still looking for a job, we have nationwide resources and local resources. I highly recommend the nationwide resources because it does give you information locally and they're just bigger, um, bigger uh, websites that have a lot more information. Um, and they're, most people will, most employers will go there to uh, post their positions. Uh, the next area I wanted to show you was the e-parachute. And this is just kind of like a fun and interesting section here. It Basically what you do is answer uh, a whole bunch of questions. And what this does is it kind of builds like a, a structure. It tells you what characteristics, what your strengths and what your weaknesses are and which jobs would probably be of interest to you or what jobs you may be better qualified for. So just, you know, if you are not sure what you want to do, just go ahead and go on here. It's just fun, something that oh, I think a lot of us have done in the past, uh, some of us have done in college, but it's just um, a fun thing that you can do to find out who you are and what job best matches your personality. Back to the to the home page, uh, as you can see, I just I'm making these little circles here just to remind you that there are people online that are available to help you. So always remember that uh, you can connect with actual veterans if you have any uh, questions regarding your veteran benefits. So they are there for you, and everything is free of cost. Under the tools for learners. This section is for people who are in, interested in going back to school. Maybe somebody wants to finish their college education. Maybe somebody has not finished their college education. Um, somebody might be interested in their GED. What this area does is it provides you with lessons, uh, practice tests. Um, it helps you to enrich your writing skills, your language skills. Um, there's ESL classes here. There's just so much information that is available. And again, this is not just for children, um, although there are um, some lessons that are for kindergarten. This goes all the way up into college. So there is a live person also on this section that can help you with if you have any um uh, trouble with math issues or English issues, um, things like that. Uh, there's also someone that's available for resumes. If you want someone to look over your resume and check the grammar, there's somebody there that can do that for you as well. Uh, I think that we'll go back to um, the home page. And that's basically everything uh, in a nutshell. If you have any questions, please feel free to give us a call. My name is Olivia, and you can call me at the Veterans Resource Center, or you can go into the uh, library's website and send me an email. Also, just to let you know, here is the information for Veterans Crisis Line in case you may know anyone that may need help. Thank you very much for listening, and we will see you next month. Bye-bye.